Oh, <laughs> oh my f- onion nuggets. All right, this is stupid food. Mm. We're gonna. Oh, uh, I'm ready for it. I'm here for it. I'm stupid fucking ready food. for it. I'm hungry. I hunger for stupid uh, food. We're gonna take a look at some TikToks. Oh, I may have to mute some of these because they use um, copyrighted obnoxious so music. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it's obnoxious usually too. Um, so let's take a look at this stupid food from TikTok. Diet white rice. Here's how to make it. Grease a bowl in lard, making sure all the edges are covered. Pour in 500 grams of egg whites and place it into a steamer pan. In a separate pan, boil some water, add the steamer pan on top and steam for 25 minutes on medium high heat. When the egg whites are firmly set, remove them from the steamer and let them cool. Use a knife to loosen it, then turn the bowl over onto a chopping board and cut it into chunks. Then I feel like my arteries are clogging just watching five times until egg whites are chopped. I mean, egg whites don't have a lot of cholesterol. It's just the whites, Scotty. Yeah, oh, okay. the whites are fine. I mean, it's just like I just don't. This, this doesn't look like, appealing. It's worse. It's uh, it's worse than white rice in every single way. This is just filthy. Yeah, I don't like this at all. This makes me feel weird. Like, and it's carnivore diet, so it's obviously stupid to begin with. You know. Yeah, this is some like, manosphere shit. Yeah, for sure. The carnivore diet is, is I, dumb, but like. Come on. It is. Texture. Put it back on your board and manually separate it some more. Transfer it to a bowl. Get a tablespoon of gelatin and sprinkle half on. Mix oh, it all together. Yeah, let, you know oh, what this, oh, needs? Oh. this needs. This needs to be more glutinous. No. This is not no. quite gluteny enough. We need to glutinous oh, up. That's terrible. Just eat some fucking oh, rice, dude. Boil some yeah. rice up. I gotta call no, out the Brits. This is some straight up enough. British shit. Oh, this you're is not some Brit shit. <laughs> I'm not mad enough unless I eat my rice and, and it's just be egg unless white I eat rice. my fucking egg white, egg white based rice. How with secure gelatin do you have it. to be? You know, <laughs> I just like the. Also, the I just want you to 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 seriously all all the viewers out there. I want you to seriously imagine what it would be like, like white rice with whatever, even just plain white rice. Put that in your mouth. Imagine that. Second gelatin infused grinded steamed white egg whites fucking disgusting it's like somebody fucking hawking a loogie in your mouth and you having to chew it up that's fucking yeah. huge it's all oily too because he basically boiled in oil he had oil and lard so it's just gonna be greasy oh yeah it's it aligned gross. with lard oh yeah. fuck. it's greasy as it'll fuck. taste like it'll taste yeah, like cum like- and feel like curdled cum <laughs> Half <laughs> put it on a baking sheet, Disgusting. covered in parchment paper, making sure it's spread out evenly. Then put uh, it in no. at 180 degrees Celsius. Take it out of the oven and turn Make it over. Put it, front of it, it looks like it. There you go. High in protein and tasted bang. Oh, I bet it is. DJ. Oh, TJ. God. Go fuck yourself, TJ. Go fuck yourself, TJ. Okay, no. If TJ joins us, then let's do it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, All right, TJ. For an impromptu 24 hours. All right, TJ, uh, go ahead and show up. When we finish up here, TJ, you can come right in the room and f- keep her going for a yeah, while. I'm happy if TJ, if you want to trade off at the end, you want to jump on and keep going. I'm yeah. fine with that. I will reiterate now that I know that you're here and listening. I worked my birthday last year and the year before that and the year before that, TJ. So not to make you feel bad, but every year, Paul's well, this- birthday. Yep. Every year. Okay, I always but do. I'm. I personally am very happy that TJ decided to take his birthday off because I I got I got to have fun tonight, you know. Oh yeah, this was I'm a happy. lot of fun. I'm happy. This has been great so far. And it definitely would have sucked if TJ was here because he sours everything with his bullshit and his doomerism. My chat is trying to get me to drink as much of this absinthe as possible. It, I am not going to obey them, but uh, they they it? want me to fucking they want obey. me to get fucked up and then they say stupid things. I'll drink more, but I'm not going to drink that much more. A visit to Queen Mav is is a great side dish to add into your meals. Far better than that pre-made package crap. That looks hideous. You're gross. (laughs) Please stay on the British Isles and never bring your egg weirdness towards me. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. That's terrible. Don't ever come here. We don't want you. We don't need you. Not my fault. You're a sucker. Good night, losers. Oh, <laughs> TJ, that, I'm. You know what? Oh, he's turning in. All right. TJ told me he was hitting I up tell some you bars what, dude. and stuff. An elephant never Wait, forgets. So does that TJ. Mean a... <laughs> yeah, he's probably he's probably drunk, and he's gonna get nice and cozy and sleep it off. And he's rubbing it. He's rubbing salt in the wound. Oh, yeah. he's rubbing. And, uh, that's one fine, out? TJ. Is that what you said? You know what? 
you plant a seed and a tree shall sprout tj well, that's all i have to say about that the fucking grapes of wrath uh, that's all i have to say all right i can tell that's already i'm gonna oh just God. guess from the preview that you that you gave me by scrolling over that i'm gonna guess this is a fucking bit yes there's no way this is real i saw nutella i think is what right. it was on there and nutella on steak is a fucking oh, no. joke that's a joke that's yeah a joke. There's, that's, that's we'll they're see. doing we'll intentionally see. bad that's going to be I my thing, by the way, is that I'm going to call out if any of these that I see as bits. I'm just going to call them out as bits. One of the things, one of my most hated things, I'm a real sourpuss, is I I, I hate fake bad cookers. I want the real bad cookers to get their True. day in the sun. True. Yeah. But it's okay. We this, can still have, I'll still have fun with it. You know, I'm just, a, screams, I'm just a cranky asshole. This screams meme to me, just looking at the center cut out of this eye round. Like, why would you ever do that? That makes no sense. I don't yeah. know, man. People do some crazy shit, so we'll have to see. I mean, yeah, it could be, it could be a work, but I don't know. Open minds, it's and like open those hearts. People, well, well, you know, I won't, I won't go off on that. I was just gonna say, people fucking butcher a lot of good steaks. I've seen lately. That's an increasing trend. Is it people is. like oh, yeah. those? Uh, that and that they waste a lot of fucking food. Salt too, which Bay makes me Golden salty. fucking terrible. Yeah, yeah, it is. Let's start by taking out the center of our top sirloin steak and then we're going to grab okay. it and place it into our hot pan grab our egg and place that right in the center we're just going to what it no it oh it's not nutella down. it's vegemite oh demon okay mama. even no. worse oh, this is the oh that changes it that changes things a little Throw bit this in the fucking trash dude yeah this is garbage i don't know if you've ever tasted Veg this demon mama i we have did had once. vegemite i it have had vegemite awful. It is. It is weird. Putrid. Okay? Yeah. Very. I don't weird. know if I can say. I don't know if I would say outright that it's like putrid. It's fucking weird though. Vegemite it is. is. It's like I understand. Like I tasted it and I was like, I don't like this. But I can get why someone would become attached to it. Have you guys ever had Moxie, the soda? Y yes. Yes, yeah. I have. I know I'm insulting Moxie by comparing it to Vegemite, but Moxie is one of those where a lot of people drink it and they and hate it and they talk about it like vegemite and i'm like i love moxie like i genuinely think moxie is amazing yeah and you know so i'm all right I, with it and yeah like I, I feel it grows on you it's one of those ones that grows on you but a lot of people hate it so i try to be a little charitable i have had vegemite and it's definitely weird this much vegemite is uh seems like a giant on a fucking beautiful steak too i mean true this is yeah awful. nutella on steak that's a story for another day. No, that said Nutella. No, she was making a joke. She said, Oh, she made a joke. That's okay. a story for another day. This is Vegemite. Okay. Okay. Grab a bag of people. No. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Okay. Cheesy poofs or whatever these are. Yeah. What the fuck is this shit, dude? Get this the fuck out of you. You don't need this to make a good steak. I love that you said cheesy poofs. I haven't yeah. heard that version of it, like the South cheesy Park poofs. specifically. Jesus. I'm a Cartman fan from back in the day, though. I haven't watched I South Park in like, so. 10 years. I, love my cheesy I, I, I know you could tell you made fun of me for it. Yeah, for like Pat, my cheesy <laughs> <laughs> you probably did. I, I, I probably did not. I'm too much I'm of so a narcissist sorry. not to watch that whole <laughs> thing. I saw what you said. No, I'm kidding. Uh, it was funny. As I'm, I laughed with you. I, 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 uh, well, I'm glad I made true. you laugh that we haven't. I'm a little Cartman. That's why I like him. I'm a little Cartman brained. I admit it. I can see I can see that. I'm Cheddar in this country, and this is going to make our side there. Cartman will rip this thing and the new asshole. There's no way. I don't know. He might eat it if he was hungry enough. And that's that what he was. Yeah. Dude, Carmel won't eat the cheesy poops. Okay. He would not want One thing I'll steak. say. This is, this is, they're Australian, right? Because they're using the Vegemite, and that is not an American brand. Yeah, that and looks I will Australian. Say, yeah. Uh, like, non-American chips and stuff like this are way better. They can And be, there are recipes good, yeah. that, like, there are recipes that, that use cheese, you know, cheetos yeah. and whatever um and they do a good job with it so i'm i'm I actually like i thought this was a bit because i thought it was um hey the i thought it was the hazelnut spread but i'm actually here to see where this goes sure. i still think it's kind of silly to use such a to, to use a steak in this way it seems pointless like why yeah. not use fucking ground beef if or something like, like that it, 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 it made it into a crust or something yeah i could see that. or a burger the, like yeah. a like a burger yeah yeah, yeah but the way they're cooking this this nice. doesn't I'm not seeing. Uh, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Poofs, Are they hoping it's gonna melt? The poofs? Yeah, I don't know. Um, I'm a, I'm a big fan of like I don't know. You guys had Frito boats. Yeah. 
That's like an American. No. Like you put you put chili and cheese on Fritos. Oh, okay, it, yeah. It's, it's really good. It's like a dip. Yeah, you it's know? just like it seems fine. Okay, wait. I want to ask you real quick. Sorry, yeah. not to distract too much, but oh, okay. Okay, if, if I said the word the 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 food type four ways, have you had them? No. No. Is that a is that like a Midwest or East Coast thing? I've never had them. No. It's definitely it's a it's a I mean, as far as I can tell, it seems to be a New England thing. Got because it. Because nobody knows what I'm talking about. It's really simple what it is. It's basically spaghetti noodles with like chili, hot dogs, cheese, crackers, onions. That kind of thing. And they call them a four way. I, had it, it was, I had it in Ohio and it wasn't called that. The chili mac in Ohio is a big deal. And I had chili mac with hot dog in it with onions and cheese. So I've had it, but I they didn't do that at, um, yeah, very Skyline Chili yeah. in, in Columbus yeah. and Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, you guys yeah. took okay. me there. We we got chili dogs there. So I've had it. Yeah. They don't call it that though. You just said it, they have a different name for it. Yeah, they do. You're yeah. Right. In in New England, everybody calls it a four way because it's, you know, but but it's like a poverty food for sure. But it's like yeah. Frito I, I, I have fond yes, memories Paul. of it, you know. Yeah, when you said Frito, but I forgot what you were saying, but yeah, they, down south they call it Frito Pie, Paul. Frito Pie, yeah. Not My Frito mom calls pie, it yeah. that sometimes too. Yeah. She She's a little sour. Frito pie, yep. At the same time, the cheeses are a little dry, so let's get it to Oh, back. milk! It's a little dry. Man, oh, that's why the not... f- oat milk? You're nah. gonna, you're making like a, a, a why the oat milk? Oh, I like God. oat milk, but not on my steak. <laughs> this is going this off is like, why rails. would you miss the like the oat milk is so oat milk is so sweet. I don't dislike oat milk, but it's crazy sweet. I what? I don't get it. I don't understand. Uh, it Peng, seems like normal cream would go good, and it, you know, I don't know. Ping, I'm actually, I'm actually this shocking. The opposite. I'm actually glad that I'm doing my little meatless uh, attempt here because, yeah, I don't want this uh, at all. At all. This either. does not look like it's going a place. This where looks. I want. This looks. It's going down fast. The oat, oh, done. Oh, like I'm. I'm done. I'm out. Gonna- Sprinkle in some of this white cheddar. This is gonna melt down. Cheese, okay. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not averse to cheese. For sure. Like cheese on mashed potatoes. But it's no, no. No. It's it's cheese on cheesy poofs. Like it's not. Except way better. As if the steak wasn't salty enough, it could always use a. Oh no! Oh my god! That Vegemite shit is salty as the day is long. So so is all the processed food. This he is has bait, a ton of right? sodium. This, this, this is a bait. sodium bomb, dude. Yeah. This has got to be. I'm starting to feel like this okay. has to be your work at this point. Because, like, you would not dump I a bunch don't know. of salt. The thing about the works is there's a tendency about, bit, like, when people are doing bit cooking or work cooking, that yeah. they always they always go way too far. This just seems like incompetence. Like, a lot of salt is something that a lot of people who Everything have, Everything like, in this pan, except there. that egg, is net, well, and the meat, is actually salty. So the Vegemite's super salty. Those chips, salty. That cheese, salty. Yeah. And she just cheese dumped, like, a fistful of salt on this. This is crazy. You're right. It could be a bit, but it does. I don't know. Usually, I, when I people do I, bits, they'll do I stuff like. I think the rationale like, is is that people watch it. It's like, what the fuck are you even making? So it's like it's because yeah, it's like. Yeah. Well, I mean, like it's, it's so it's so outside of the realm of what you would normally make. So it, I think it intrigues you. Like, what the fuck is it going to be? Yeah. yeah. A nice flavors come out. Really oh, that's good a lot of fucking yeah. pepper, lady. One, Jesus one pound of salt later. Oh man, I'm gonna sneeze also, sympathetically from that pepper. I'm 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 trying not to be too judgy here, but there's something that there's something that screams incompetent chef when you have a fucking obviously expensive automatic salt and uh, salt and pepper grinder. Like, how fucking hard is it to like True. grind salt and pepper? Like, come on now, do you really need lithium? Like, child slave mind lithium to power your fucking cordless. A grinder, you just but go like this. So much, it looks so much better on the TikTok, though, Demon Mama. When I use my expensive OXO hand grinder with oh, around. shut the fuck up. My chat is like, maybe she has carpal tunnel. Shut the fuck up. You're not gonna call me ableist oh, because of no. fucking... yeah, bullshit. How many, how many um, of those fucking child slaves oh. that mine that lithium? How much carpal tunnel do you think those people have, huh? I don't fuck know, off. but you know, my carpal tunnel is acting real bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. he actually gave me some of these though, so I'm sorry. Oh, shit, some. Scotty, you have the you have these. Oh, you no, have, yeah. 
It was a gift to me, though, okay. so blame yes, TJ. Not, you have an excuse, yeah. Blame it's TJ. Blame TJ's me, the I'm one that wanted those kids in the mines to be fucking working. My my bougiest, uh, my bougiest thing that I own is those sunglasses back there, which are fucking Hideo Kojima designer sunglasses. And those, I, could, I they were a gift. They were a fucking gift. You can't fucking hate me for them. All right? Yeah, absolutely. Um, Yeah, but... And Scotty, I mean, yeah, of course, TJ got you this. I mean, game. TJ, he, he doesn't I, give a fuck about I think child he actually slavery. W- went for the model that had more child labor and suffering. He probably so did, just, yeah. I mean, so no, blame TJ. TJ again, again, blame TJ, not me. I'm innocent. Let's I'll add blame TJ. Spicy. This one has some. Oh, this shit now, is that sauce. Um, that sauce, that truffle sauce, is actually fucking legit. It's I bet it is. I, it I, looks. This has been everywhere. Spot, People have been memeing on this truff sauce. I like I've been seeing it in tons of videos. I saw a, I saw a cooking video the other day that was like a scooped bagel, which is one of the saddest things I've ever seen. And they were using yeah. this fucking hot sauce. This hot sauce is fucking paying people. I'm telling you. Oh, for uh, sure. yeah, for sure. Yeah, they're probably promoting this on TikTok. This is so flavorful. You really don't need that much, but it's gonna add that nice color. Pretty much gonna match the inside. Don't of the need cake. that much. Let me pour half this bottle on it. By the <laughs> way, that truff sauce is expensive as. I got one of their tiny little jars of mayonnaise, and I was like, okay, because I'm going to splurge on at least one thing. I usually do that at a store, and that was on sale. That shit's good, yeah. but it is super fucking expensive, I man. Bet. It's like, it looks like it. It's, it's like eight bucks, it's nine good. bucks for a little tiny fucking How container. much was it? Eight or nine dollars on sale. Ah, oh, just get yourself like some Cholula at that point. Shut Come on, the there's no door. way this there's no way this shit from, outweighs Cholula. I'm from Cholula. the South. We got Tabasco. Try to get no Cholula. Oh, you do the Tabasco, I say. Well, Cholula yeah. is the Texas one. Everybody in Texas likes Cholula. I, don't Cholula. Want no, I, I love no Texas you ever had stuff it? now. You know what I keep around? Maybe you ever had it though, for real? I've had it. I don't you know, know what it. I keep it's around good. now because I live down there in Louisiana? Tony Satcher's yeah. boy. Tony Satcher boy. You, you know, know what you're talking about? Down, down the bayou, boy. Tony Satcher's. Down by the bayou, we used to grab them crawfish by the heads and suck the tails, oh, man, oh. with them Tony Satcher's sprinkled on top. That's the stuff. It right is crawfish there. season, dude. Crawfish are in season. Mm. Cooking oh. I think it's time to mash this up a little. Look at that. Oh, Ooh, it's squishy. Oh. Yuck. Mm, look at the squelchy. Yeah, it's all mushy because she put milk Yummy. all over the chip. So now it's like milk that's uh, or uh, cereal uh, from the milk. Too I'm long. out. I'm out. I'm yeah, out. Me too. This is bad. Um, I told you the oat milk was the end for me. There was no way this comes back from the oat milk. Yeah, you ain't no. saying this, vet- lady. Yeah. So the much Vegemite. juice is going to cook off that steak. You did not need more liquid in this pan. It's going to be so wet. much fat and good yeah. stuff is going to cook off that steak that you would have been able to do this anyway. Meal. This is definitely ready to flip. I don't think it, is. it looks rare as fuck still. Why why did they leave the egg in there in the first place? Oh. Oh, that's not it's even a good sear on it. Yeah. Oh no, where's oh, the shit. sear? God damn it. All right, oh, sorry. Where's the sear? There's no sear. Mm-hmm. Heat wasn't high Ew. enough. Is- <laughs> it's like the steak threw up. It's diarrhea. Oh my god! Sauce, it looks. Dude. It li- it no. pumps stomach. Pump stomach. It's yeah, bad. This is, it's this is, bad. This is a bad like, day. It's like, porcelain god. God right it's like here. someone it's was business. cooking. It was like someone was cooking a steak with an egg in the middle, and you came and threw up in the pan. <laughs> like I'm sorry, yeah. bro. I couldn't. I it couldn't was like you in. were cooking, oh, and somebody distracted you while their fat friend took a liquidy dump on your steak. <laughs> <laughs> it's gross. It's you know, bad. wait. You know it's bad when they're the only egg in the dish is the whole egg in the center that's still got its shell on, yeah. and somehow everything looks like pureed egg. That is a Ugh. very bad fucking sign. That is. <laughs> Oh God! What would I do if somebody put this in front of me? I don't know what I'd do. I'd probably take two bites out of politeness and run as fast as I could. No, I wouldn't take a bite. I would be like, "I'm sorry, I'm not putting that in my mouth. That's an insult." Uh, there's a, a there's a relationship, stronger, okay? There's a contract, all right? When somebody's cooking you food, when, when somebody's cooking you food, okay? It's nice yep. of them to do, but it's also nice of you to eat it because food can fucking kill you. So you're sure. trusting them, and they're trusting you. It's a it has to be a handshake. And if somebody puts this in front of me, they are fucking slapping me in the face, and I will not put that shit in my mouth. I'm so yeah. sorry. No, nah, I oh agree. Oh, my God. Uh, you know what? I agree. I would still eat it, though, because I'm socially awkward, and I don't want to offend anybody. But all around. Oh, that's fair. And I like to put it in right before You'd be shitting for days. Oh, you Spend. know what this needed? It was some fucking scallions, some shallots or whatever. This what these, these scallions. You know what? Scallions, I, take I think, back. yeah. I, those scallions, 
really tie the room together like the dude's right. <laughs> I... It's really saving it. Oh, my God. Yep. I'm ready to eat now. All right, let's grab a plate. We're gonna start with our eggy guy here. Yeah. Now let's oh grab no! Our plate. Oh, it looks like a fucking. It looks like a fucking blown out asshole. It does. It looks like a prolapsed asshole. It does. This looks like prolapse porn. We're gonna get banned. Unclean prolapse, prolapse porn. Prolapse no, alert. no, they didn't do they. They didn't do their fucking fleet before fleet edema. This looks like Michael Knowles oh. if he bends over. <laughs> Right back in you go, buddy. <laughs> that back, that backside is blown out. That backyard. Oh, oh, oh God, that is that horrible. Look, Look at the chunks. Do oh everybody my God. a favor it... and take that outside and throw it in the trough for the fucking hogs to eat, please. This is not. Oh human my food. God, this is horrible. Cheezels turned into the perfect mashed potato. So creamy. Though that is what not. What are you talking about? That have, is not mashed you... potatoes. Where have you ever seen a mashed potato that even looks remotely like that? I have, That looks like what happens when you fucking cut open somebody's fatty liver and turn it inside out. That's the fucking, that looks like the fucking, like, fat deposits when you're dying of liver disease. Yeah, it really does. It really, it, it looks like they cut open an alcoholic's liver and scooped out all the fucking dead flesh from where it, it's fucked. There you go. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Let's give this little slice. Wow. We're chefs. All right. Well, at least the meat is done right. So points there, I okay. guess. But I'm, I'll pass. I'm actually surprised by that. I'm, yeah, I'm the actually meat actually surprised. looks quite nice. That's a nice little medium fairly, rare. Yeah. yeah. Medium rare, yep. Damn. Hot pink Damn. inside. That's good okay. shit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to have to Everything else one. looks think, fucking putrid. I'm going to have to disagree. I think it's overcooked. Sure. You think so? You like I it like rare? Little, I like it rare, too. I tend to like it very rare. I like but, my steak but, blue. But I can handle it. Okay. All right. I like it a little rarer than that, but it was, I was not expecting Terrible. to see any pink in there. Terrible. Um, no, you're wrong. Sorry. And then, no. like, this, wait, hold up. She, you, you crack the egg in the steak, so you get eggshell in the steak. Am I seeing this right? We're chefs. We're chefs. We're dry. No, that's no, dry city right there. Not, I'm telling you, you I don't think, I don't think that steak is good. Ah, no, come on. Oh, here's yeah. your soupy fucking egg <laughs> and a bunch this of eggshell, too. Because that, that's swimming. what this dessert, that's what this needs this is, is the egg This is terrible. This is abominable. Is swimming in, this is swimming in sauce. This is so fucking confused. It's garbage. The steak is dry. The fucking cheesy I don't think poops. this is a bit. I don't think this is a bit. I don't think so either. It's, uh, it's horrible. I'm going to break with real conventional wisdom. I'm, I think this is rage bait. This is making me too mad to look at. I think this person knows what they're doing. I think they're trying to get haters to go like, this looks gross a bunch of times and get up in the algorithm. You think so? That's I feel I'm like going. if they do, like... Whenever, see, I would agree with you, but if so, it's being done incompetently because the way that you get rage bait is you got to do something like a, above and beyond. The oat milk is gross. It's disgusting, but it's not like outrageous. Like the answer for that, in my opinion, would be to take like, um, like, like, hmm, like grenadine instead of oat milk. And you, you mix yeah. the grenadine in with the cheese and that makes people go fucking crazy because it's, that's. You know, the dumb people are going to get really mad. The people who don't realize it's a bit. This one, I'm like, she didn't go far enough to make it a successful bit. You know what I mean? Because, like, you could yeah. get way more views by making it like, oh, you you pick up some dog shit in your yard. Yeah, like over the top. Can. Yeah. True like, fact. there's this one person who does, like, they'll put, like, a banana peel in the recipe. And I'm like, come on. Like, obviously, like, they're obviously pissing somebody. You try to piss people off. But... I don't know. Maybe, maybe it, it could still be a bit, but I'm gonna guess that it's not a bit. I'm gonna guess it's not a bit. My head says bit, and my heart says bad uh, mm. cook. Uh, but now yeah, Paul, I mean, I think you, Paul, you go I either way. Dangerous. This is some spam loaf ramen. Oh, I know. Wait this a second. Oh, this is no, probably spam. gonna be amazing. Scotty loves spam, by the way, Demon Mama. This is gonna be amazing. Look, okay, Paul, you're Scotty wrong. is a spam wrong. person. Horrible taste. Spam, Once very famously, go ahead. Spam has its place, and also, yes, spam. I'm noticing this is a Korean video, and spam is very, very, yes. very popular in Korea and in Geniuses. China. Um, specifically, Asia broadly they, as specifically well. pan seared, yeah, pan island. seared spam. And I will agree that I have actually enjoyed spam ramen in the past. 
but I'm looking at this right Welcome. now, and this is feeling already like it looks like it's going to go too far. I can tell it's not too much already. Enough. It's too much, man. Wrong. Wrong. Cube got cube that spam. So up you really love spam. I might even eat it. I, I love, yeah, Scotty I would eat this all day long. Spam is one of the greatest things that was ever invented by the Western world. Scotty yeah, once okay. um, famously almost made me vomit by eating a can of spam with the <laughs> jelly live on a. Ew. Uh, all right. Come hour. on. No. Now. Yeah, he ate the jelly. I, you um, know what sucks, Paul? They don't do the jelly anymore. That's what I hear. Yeah. It's you, so hey, sad, at least, dude. At least you almost made me throw up a bunch Why? of McDonald's breakfast. What was in the jelly that I they would... had to get rid of? I don't know. I think they cheated People hated out. It. it was gross. I think they found out a way to do it without it, and they were like, "Yeah, it's gonna make it more appetizing. Let's get rid of the." Isn't jelly. that like how the the you know the Doritos they they know how to make it so they're not dusty, but they they're like we keep the dust because it's a it's a part of the experience. Yeah, the Cheeto fingers or the that. Dorito fingers. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah so a lot delicious. of people were more mad when the jelly went away because, like Scotty, they liked it. Okay, That's I know this is like not to do with any of this, but have can you can I get some validation here? Have, are either of you did you did either of you used to eat Pringles like when you were a kid? Oh, all the time. Oh yeah, I used to pop the right. Pringles all Pringles, the time. I, I, I don't Pringles now here. suck. They do. Yes. What can change? They uh, blow tr now. Shrinkflation, cutting costs, and changed uh, recipes, changed ingredients. Yep. The tube has they gotten smaller. The chips have gotten smaller. There's less of them in there. You rarely open a can and get a full can. It's already like a third gone when you open it. it they just suck. I now. swear to fucking God, they used to be. They used to be so perfect. God tier. Oh, I love they were like core. a god tier chip, Ooh. especially the salt and vinegar ones were like yes. next level. And now True they're text. just like. If it they don't taste like potato anymore. They they taste like they're corn. They might be potato, but but they taste preservatives, very corn. emulsifiers, things basically. To, well, because what they do is is they take out they take out some of the potato and they add other ingredients in to basically make that yeah bigger, yeah basically make they it go, go further it. yeah to get more so basically get more value oh, for the okay. company but less for the customer, which is why you've noticed that the taste has changed dramatically. Yeah. Uh, by sucks. the way, ramen package ramen has also undergone massive shrinkflation they're tiny now in comparison to what they were True. just 10 years and ago 33 cents most of them the anyway uh, some of the some of the like korean brands that you get that are hell expensive are still pretty big yeah i but, buy some at world market and they're still legit but those are from south korea yeah, the maruchans yeah. and nissans and nissans or whatever the fuck, those are done um, okay i'm gonna mute this one because i don't want to listen to that yeah. Um, okay. So it's so cheese and spam. That? It's more okay, spam. So let's go back. It's hard to tell. I can't read the Korean here. I think that's Korean. So I it looks cheesy. Yeah, it's cheese. Korean. It's more. It's like more more spam. Kind of meat. Yes. More spam. Oh my god. Oh, wow. my god. oh it's fine. They that make is spam a log. like that. All right. Come on. Come on. This what? Is... I have been living a lie. But they're wasting. I've been living a. Okay. So lie. wait. No, they returned the spam back in. In yes. the look at that, Scotty. Look, look at the show. size. Okay. That's 1.18 1 or 1.81 kilograms, Scotty. That is amazing. Spam that's number one. Honkous, that's oh. a spam loaf. Dude, this looks like a, that's a whole ass loaf of spam. True. Dude, that's a newborn baby of spam right there. That's Beautiful. four pounds of that's four yeah. pounds of spam. That's an that's average size nuts. newborn of spam. I want to hug this spam. Okay. I want to kiss the spam. I want the spam to be in my stomach right now. All seriousness, though, no spam hate. Just cooking analysis, real quick. Okay. This seems like a terrible way to cook four pounds of spam. It like, does. I it's see what they're trying the to middle. do. They're making a novelty, but like, don't you think that slicing anyway. it would have made the spam taste more? Because the spam, what makes spam good, in my opinion, at least, where you can like enjoy it, is when it's the, got that crispy layer that you see on the outside. Yeah, caramel. It's caramel. Crispy. This looks crispy. This looks, crispy. this looks perfectly cooked. I, I have to say, <laughs> I have to completely disagree. What about these guts, though, totally Scotty? These guts fan. look pretty gray and woke. I mean, yeah, I, yeah. I, I will stand spam to the day I die. Cheesy oh my noodles. God. That is delicious. That more spam in Delicious. there. Delicious. Yeah, even right. more spam. All right. I mean, okay. 10 out of 10. All right. Perfect. Beautiful. Um, All right. This is, is not that bad. This is not that bad. It's it's a stupid novelty making like a bread bowl, but instead doing like a spam bowl. Um, Horribly miscategorized. Very, this is not stupid food, by the way. This one is going to be. To me, it's mildly stupid, but this not is like brilliant food. Way. There should be a subreddit called the brilliant cheese, food. 
the, the cheesy Beautiful. noodles look fine. They seem fine to me. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, they do seem fine. I will say I don't I don't approve of the preparation method of the spam. Personally, I feel like just making the cheesy noodles and then searing two mm-hmm. large slices of spam would have done the job. But I don't know. It doesn't seem that bad, honestly. It's very this spammy, gonna, but you know, if you this like is going to be a pass fun. for me. This is going to be a nope, my my There's guys. No way you eat this. Oh, okay. Sure. I can't do this one. Yeah, this one. I don't think I'd be able to get it down me. We um, we made Paul spam. Like, was it three or four different ways? And Paul cannot stomach it. I can't. Oh, no, I, 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 I have a real bad gag reflex with foods that gross me out, and spam is at the <laughs> real high on my I list. I get that. I mean, I can completely um, understand. So, spam yeah, has like, uh, especially uh, in its raw. It's not the worst yeah. thing. <clears throat> yes yeah totally agree all right come on and load don't don't all croak right. on me now internet we're almost there we've almost made it don't i promise now. this isn't an snl sketch is the name of this all let's, right we'll see let's look you love delicious hot meals but recipes can be time consuming and complicated and what a mess you're left to clean but imagine if you could make dinner with no pots and pans. no it's kathy what's her name i yeah this is the infomercial grandma lady. You can eat that okay. book. I used though? to watch her back in the day when I was. Eat this book. Oh, my chat. All of the, the hardcore this. cooking mama fans are sussing this one already. In my website chat, we've got the we've got my core cooking mama fans, and they're sussing this one already. That's a bad oh, sign. Okay. They well, got it. They're trained they're right. well. They're trained well. We'll see. We'll see, yeah. Yes. Let's see if they're right. Hey, Kathy Mitchell here with Eat This Book, my new collection of recipes that you prepare and cook on a page from the book. It's dinner made easy. Ooh. Okay, that's fucking gross. This is you're what? cooking it in a newspaper no. or whatever. It's, they made. I mean, I know. I think they made the book parchment. out of baking sheet. Yeah, it's I know baking some. It's got I know some Asian. But why would why would you do it? Some Asian cultures will 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 cook like this in a banana leaf. Okay, or, that makes sense though, because a banana right. leaf will stay together, right? And then part some flavor. If you make as well. that, if you make a buffalo chicken casserole, you're gonna rip through the paper, even if it's baking paper. It's gonna be soggy as fuck. I don't know. Yeah. I'm already sus of this. This seems this seems stupid. Watch. Yeah. Just tear out a page and put the ingredients right on the pictures. It's that easy. Then fold. Okay, this is stupid as fuck. <laughs> yeah, this, this, is, this is like a pain by but, numbers cooking. Yeah, but also I will say this does seem like she's actually trying to sell the product. Obviously, sure. this is like a it, it's amped up for an infomercial, but it clearly seems like she thinks this is a product she can sell. I don't think she's True. faking this. I don't think she is either. And yeah. bake for a delicious meal every time, guaranteed. Wow, have they heard of seasoning? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can I get some pepper? Can we take some of the pepper off that Vegemite steak and throw it on that shrimp? Big ziti. Oh, this is a nightmare, dude. This yeah, is this sucks. A, this does not look good. This sucks. This is gross. This, it, fuck, this, this is sucks. This is a real, I think this is a real deal. Just this fucking sucks. Yeah. Uh, common Dima Mama chat W, I guess. Because, yeah, they were yeah. right about this one. They sussed this one and they were right. To make the perfect yeah. meal every day. No more messy pans to clean. Finished? Just toss it in the trash. Oh, bullshit. Bullshit. Fucking bullshit. Done. There's no way. The There's trash, no way man. that doesn't fucking soak through. You're trying to tell me. You're trying to tell me fucking acidic ass tomato sauce is not gonna fucking soak through some shitty low quality baking paper. Bullshit. Look at that. It's not even wet on her hands, DM. It's because yeah, because that's, that's a dry piece. Bullshit. It's a dry piece. Bullshit. Oh, it isn't. She just cut you, Scotty. Look, she just cooked penne a la vodka in it. <laughs> right. Perfect meal every day. Look at that cheese pull. No nice cheese. Look at that paper. Sorry, Get it out of here. Toss it in the trash. Toss it away. Here's a simple salmon recipe. Add some asparagus. Cover with ranch dressing and lemons. Then fold. Oh, why? What a way to ruin your fucking salmon. Ranch on your salmon? What's wrong with you? That is some fucking white bitch bullshit. I'm calling that fucking garbage right there. Okay, I love this, by the way. This one, this one is a good one. Right here, this is some that she believes that's a good recipe. You could tell. Even though this is an infomercial, you can tell she thinks people are going to buy this. And it's some fucking ranch on salmon? That's fucking bullshit. What the fuck? Ranch and salmon go together. Yeah, this oh is... Oh, my this, God. This, this sounds I'm about offended. white to me. This sounds about white to me. It's wrong. It's so wrong. There's like... 
it's the wrong flavor profile for salmon altogether. That's bullshit. You won't even be able to taste the fucking fish. No, chat. Oh, don't get too crazy. Ranch is not gross. It's just no, gross. Ranch is, fish. ranch is great. Ranch is fantastic. It has its applications. It's yes. it's it's got a, it's got a lot of applications. Okay, ranch is really fucking good for certain things, particularly True. veggie platters. It's great on a veggie platter. It goes really good with like celery and other vegetables. It's a great dressing for salads, etc. Not for fucking salmon. Salmon, you want minimal flavorings that bring out the flavor of the salmon. You want some lemon, maybe. Maybe you want a little bit of ginger. Maybe you mm -hmm. want a tiny, tiny bit of honey if you like it honey-wise. You maybe a little bit of soy sauce. Nothing that I'm you having don't want. A, salmon is I'm, one of the most flavorful fish. I'm having it with teriyaki tonight, which I think is going to be good. It's going to be glazed great. with a little I teriyaki. I bet that's going to be fantastic. Teriyaki is fantastic for salmon because – Teriyaki brings like a a savory uh, grilled touch to stuff. That's, that's what like I want. Perfect for salmon. Yeah, that's exactly. What, I want. Um, what are you fucking talking? Don't you fucking dare tell me that. Sorry, I'm yelling at my chat. They're fucking telling me I have fucking. Hey, bub, I'm gonna fuck you right up. Okay, there, bub. Shit. They're saying I I betrayed my fucking Mainer roots. They're fucking, don't ever tell me that. Don't you ever fucking tell me that. TFW when that absinthe is kicking. Oh, oh look at this. Oh, no, the salmon. Oh, no, it's all good. That was I'm getting a, little, getting a little heated. Go for it. Oh, you, you, you do it whenever you want. This salmon is overcooked. I hate the Yeah, this salmon this looks like cat food. Bone dry. Yeah. Bone this cat dry. Food. With no seasoning. No I taste. wouldn't even feed this to my cat. Salmon, so delicious. Or choose another. No, I would, but page. I wouldn't eat it. Start with boneless chicken thighs. Then fill the spaces with frozen peas and ham. It's like coloring with food. <laughs> How infantile do you need to be to have this appeal to you? It's like coloring with food. No, oh, shit. All oh, right. I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't ready. Sorry. I wasn't ready for that one. That one stuck <laughs> up on me. That's good. <laughs> Give me a sec. All right. All right. I'm good. I got a little sweat. I'm beating up. A da, da, bit. Da, da, da. <laughs> what a what a world we live in oh jesus all right give me a sec <laughs> it's like coloring with food all right um how right. stoned is paul a new I'm game for I'm super stoned. i'm super stoned <laughs> it's like coloring with food <laughs> it broke paul it oh broke it did him. it did it was bound to happen covered with cream of chicken soup and grated oh <laughs> Oh wait! Just, chicken, wait, is it, did you see cream of chicken? Get your barrel-chested cousin to come in and jizz all over your chicken. <laughs> oh f me! Oh, oh, gross. gross! He's got dude. he's got that he's got that sulfur water come. You know when yeah, you've been he, drinking he the Florida water too much. <laughs> he eats a lot. He eats a lot of pineapple. It'll be great. It'll be great. That, that makes it sweet, not yellow. Know, yellow, yum. you gotta you gotta get that sulfur to pass through for that one. <laughs> oh God! You gotta you, you need that's the that's the that's the tainted <laughs> that's the tainted cum supplements come. Okay. Oh, you're so, oh, oh, oh man, <laughs> fuck this. You hungry, Paul? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> This is disgusting. It's like a uh, bomb. It's like a bukkake went off in that fucking parchment, dude. And there's some chicken I think I'm having, with it. This is, I think I'm you know that like, you know that Reddit like, post. You know that Reddit extreme. post about the cum box. <laughs> you know that Reddit post it about is, the cum box. The one that. Oh, did you ever tell you that story? No. TJ's no. TJ's balls swole up one time. And he oh. squeezed them, and a bunch of pus came out of his dick. Oh, no! Yeah. <laughs> no, that can't be. Can't be sad, right. but true. Uh, he's, ask he's, him. Ask him. He swears up and down it's true, and I I oh tend to believe God. him when he does that. Listen, uh, I, TJ has a problem of ignoring health problems like that. He does. So yeah, oh, I does. 100 no. oh, believe oh, it. That's, that's fucking terrible. Yeah. Holy <laughs> and it probably Why are my looked balls like this. swelling up, boys. It it's probably like, well, what came out of his balls. What came out of his infected balls probably looked <laughs> more appetizing than this. <laughs> I'd rather <laughs> slurp <laughs> that than this. <laughs> This is hideous. Oh, yeah. oh my god. That it's, it's, oh, it's terrible. I mean, mom, <laughs> I, guess there, I guess there is cum in it, so sure. Mom, were there no rotten rat, rat corpses laying around the house? Like, are we really this bad off? What is this? For cat measuring, <laughs> fill the pictures, and your recipes will turn out perfect every time. Oh, yeah, really fuck measuring. Steak. 
Yeah, get rid of the measuring and cooking, man. It's so Never. difficult to measure things, after all. It is. I mean, you need all those plastic things. There's got to be a better way. <laughs> There's got to be a better way. Oh. Oh. It's like coloring with all right. food. I, I'll be honest. That okay. stew looks kind of legit. It's, I like it looks stew, like though. It looks like Dinty Moore. It yeah, looks it about on, on par with the low-end can can stuff so this is the I worst i might i might slurp down this stew i'm a stew apologist i'm a country boy so i like a meaty potatoey stew and, stews might... are good. and stews always stew? look a little yeah oh yeah we i mean i guarantee you this fucking doesn't but i haven't seen flavor, them hit i haven't hit, seen them hit a it's single edible. one of these with yeah. salt so the stew is probably bland as the fucking day is long so yeah, yeah, but whatever, it looks okay. It doesn't look horrible. It looks like a stew, you know. It does. Stew always has a little bit of a. It always has a little bit of a brown gunk factor. Oh, you want a little dessert, Demon there Mama? Here we go. Oh. Ginger snacks and butter. Spread over the top and bake. Then reveal. This is cheating. Yeah, the bullshit. Is. No, that is yeah. not what it turns out like. That is fucking bullshit. To Beautiful make cobbler. Fucking, that is no way. No. Beautiful way. cobbler. Tremendous like cobbler. It's a crisp, mm -hmm. actually. Wrong. Crisp. That's fucking bullshit. They're faking. Yes. That's fucking bullshit. There's no fucking way. Delicious. Cool. Throw that over a little ice cream, Demon Mama. What you think about that? Uh, they, they faked that one. They faked that they one. Faked you that think? One. What do you think this thing's 100%. gonna be worth? They're gonna Since say they have, it's. How much are they charging for this warlock? Payments, three easy payments of fifteen ninety nine or something like that. Nineteen. Right. They're gonna put it for like fifty bucks or something. Because you know they got to recoup the fact that they actually have to bind the book with the book with the baking paper in it. But wait, that means that people won't buy it. But okay, but it's being marketed to stupid people. So I'm going to say about fifty bucks. I'm going to say fifty bucks is what they try to do it for. Okay, I'm going to abstain because I actually saw it. Nineteen ninety-five, boy. So I will abstain because it would, would be cheating. All right, all right, yeah, all don't right. cheat, Paul. Don't cheat. Fourteen ninety-nine. Oh, oh wow! Oh. I got owned. That's a oh deal. shit! Wait, hold on a second. I was stupid. I was stupid because I was thinking about 2024 prices, and this is obviously like a like an early 2000s thing. So that it would have been smart. Way, yeah, yeah. It I, got that way. I got owned. I got owned. I got owned. I Scotty, you were closest. Order now, and we'll send you another 50 pages free. That's wow! Dinners. Damn, a hundred dinners. That's pretty good for 15 bucks. Yeah, I'm buying that's that not bad. Here. Of course, that shipping and handling is going to be a chunk. It always it's is. It's going to be like seven more dollars. Yeah. Yeah, at least. Call right now and you can get a second full book. Just okay. Wait a minute. Double it up now for two hundred dinners. You tell me you don't want two hundred dinners. That's a deal. You can give what you can use them both, or you can give one as a gift for free. You could. I don't know. That's crazy. I'm starting to, I'm starting Wait. To now it like says and good. separate fee. Hold on, look at that. They added something else in. Oh, they did. You're right. And shipping and shipping separate handler and fee. separate fee. So you got to pay shipping. Oh, handler twice. twice. Yeah. yeah. Which is going to be they're, they're, they're another $14.99. The thing about these ones, all these shipping and handling ones, they scrape extra from the shipping and handling because oh, they're allowed. They, to they jack that up massively. Yeah. It doesn't cost $7 to mail anything else. Like Amazon ain't paying $7 to mail. Should I call now. this number and see if they pick up right now? Yeah, call it and see if you can get one of these. Because I put, dude, a cooking see, mama stream it. where you cook the book. On this. Yeah, you hold make on, that stew. See if it's still Let's there. See. Hold on. Let me put it on, on speakerphone. Let's see. Yeah, do it. Yeah, we can hear that phone. Hello. Please listen carefully as the number you have dialed may have changed. Oh, it's, it's dead. recorded for quality assurance. Yeah, it's gone. Press one now for English. Yep, yeah, it's that's, dead. That's the death Damn. now. This is no longer the eat this book hotline. I did it. Hey, look. I fucking did it for you. That means More you all got to throw some donos in here, okay? Because we may have met the goals, but these these fucking lovely, our, our lovely hosts deserve more more tips. And I just fucking called a 1-800 number for you all. So Very throw true. some donos in there. Also, I got to use the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah, you go right ahead. Yeah. Scotty and I will take a look at another recipe here while waiting for you. Hello, AITJ 2.0 here. I have taken over your free will. Bill, Bill. You will subscribe and become a pessimist productions. Hey, patron. You will enjoy live streams of Onion Nuggets every week and other shows such as Sloppy Seconds, Abandoned Hope, Ideology, You're Wrong, Fighting Boys, and more. Click the link. I have no hands, so you must click. Click, 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 click. Crock -pot, Crock pot tenders. Oh, no. I mean, maybe it could work. Why do I have so much trepidation about this? Yeah, that doesn't mean seem like it goes together. It doesn't, be floppy, but you know, right? They can't be. They can't be. Okay, so these are the store bought. 
Okay, so tenders, frozen tendies. Going in the crock pot. All right. Frozen. Barbecue sauce. Okay. Sauce. Now we're going to take some sweet baby Ray's hot sauce. Now, depending on how much spice you like, this is all up to you. Now, you can measure with your heart. You can put as much as you like, put as little as you like. Now we're going to come in with measure some with white pepper. Heart. Now we're going to come in with some smoked paprika. Now we're going to come in with... Now we're going to come in with... <laughs> I'll tell you what, now we're going to come Lastly, in with this. we're going to come in with some more dry Dude, okay, I love. I'm gonna come in with that. I'm, I'm gonna come in with this. Now, I done yeah. grow up in the South, boy, and I can tell you when someone putting on that accent and she putting it on, boy. Mm-hmm. You think so? She thinks she putting it oh, on a little bit. You think I think she, she probably she has a mild, a mild Southern accent at most, yeah. and is putting it. She's on city slicking. She's city slicking. Mm-hmm. She probably, like she probably does live in the South, but she probably is like. Dude, a lot of people in the South nowadays, I mean, like, you live in a city, you know, it's not, I won't say it's cosmopolitan, but. Yeah, she probably lives in downtown Gainesville or something like yeah. that, all cosmopolitan. You're, yeah, you live in Nashville or some shit. It's well, like, oh, yeah, I'm really living in the country life. It's like, you're no, you're not. You're living in a city no, life. You ain't. Yeah, you are. It's mixed up in this crock pot. You're just going to take your spoon and you're just going to want to stir all. Gotta coat them frozen nuggies. Together. You're going to take your crock pot lid and place it right over there. And you're going to want to cook this on high for about an hour. Oh. Wow. That's a steamy boy right there. Wow. You, you know, you could do also, you could just air fry those same tendies in about 15 minutes max, and it would you taste could. better and crispy. And you could just pour the sauce on it. You could do that or dip it in the sauce, you know, or yeah. whatever. Wow. And actually be able to use your fingers too. Can you smell that? Go ahead and try it. We'll get this. Oh, that's it's mush. Up. It's Those are not oh, tenders. It that's is. mush. Yep, you're Those right. Cooked the mush. Right. Go ahead and take a bite. All right, cheers, guys. Oh, <laughs> ah, dude, one bite. Dude, she has tucked that fucking bite in her cheek like a chipmunk, and she is spitting it out after this video. What is it? What have I missed so far? How bad is it? This is a barbecue sauce. It's frozen chicken tenders. You throw them frozen directly in the crock pot. You pour barbecue sauce and spice on them. You cook them for an hour. They come out rubbery and overcooked and saucy oh. and she took a bite and she said you're gonna want to keep this on high for about an hour wow can you smell that go ahead and try it we'll get this this little guy right here mm, so right, soggy guys. kind of actually she needed to cover that <laughs> bite in ranch too yeah, yeah nah. so this is, yeah this is <laughs> this is astro right here yeah this garbage no. it looks it looks rubbery you can I'm see i'm gonna on keep the on air frying rubbery. my chicken nuggies and my chicken tendies yeah thank you you do that this is the one i was waiting to get to uh, all right oh this okay. is sacrilege dude this TJ is a controversy all right yeah. if tj saw this dude oh uh, he loses his mind oh no we're pouring Blasphemy. we're pouring dude, a quarter gallon blasphemy. of milk dude a yeah. i gotta say right away right away the the thing about oreos and milk and they and it is true that oreos are milk's favorite cookie they are incredibly good with milk but they the are. problem the thing with them is you have to get them in the sweet spot because once they completely dissolve there's no point anymore if they don't even you don't get any of it right it, yeah like so this completely immediately fails just immediately fails the it check. does it also does. I don't know if you guys have tried. Did you guys ever get to try the Swedish fish Oreos, the novelty Swedish fish Oreos that they not. put out for a while? I did not. Yeah. Foul. Foul. Just total gross. trash. Just and they sold like, them in full packages. I like packages. Swedish fish too. I, I like. Swedish. I like Swedish okay. fish too, but they do not. They do not mix well. We tried them just because they were a novelty item that was sold in certain grocery stores for a while. They yeah. failed completely. They weren't even fun. There are no some bueno. novelty snacks that they sell that are like, okay, this is cool and and kind of fun. You know, like they did like the um, I think it was Peeps, where they did Peeps. like the 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 Peepsy, you know? And it was like it was Pepsi that had peep flavoring. Wasn't very good, but Dude, it was a I fun novelty. Get, I used to get the Peeps hookups because my ex mother in law found out I hated Peeps and she thought it was cute every Easter to send me all the Peeps merch and a bunch yeah, of like yeah specialized peeps so but i hated them um uh, peeps are not a good they're not a good treat like but they're cute they have they're the cute. benefit of being adorable they're actually like we have we never buy peeps but i have one official peeps stuffed animal and yeah. it is really fucking cute they're yeah. peeps are like it's, a good idea really for like cute. one bite 
I'm kids telling you, love like, them. For me, like, I think I think dude, they're kids. like one peep. It's one peep is good. And yeah. but after that, yeah. it, it, the flavor is so repetitive. You just don't want to eat any more than that. Yeah. Agreed. I remember we would get peeps as a kid and it would be exactly like that. We'd eat one or two out of the package That's and like the rest that. would go stale, you know, yeah. cause you just don't go back for them anyway. Yeah. Oreos soaking. Change that joy to sorrow, dude. Put yeah. sorrow. sorrow is what it should say on that. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait a second. Fat free fucking milk. Uh, get okay. out of here, you Again, bitch. double failure. Like what the fuck? Is the free? point if you're going to make no. an entire package of Oreos soggy in milk, you're gonna go with fat free milk that you uh, may as well soak them in fucking water. Bullshit. Yeah, yeah at, least at least two percent. At least pour 2%. some whole milk on that, like a real fucking American. I'm sick of this. Oh, uh, that's be right. so bad. Look, yeah. I am a I look obviously given my weight, I am kind of a fat free milk hater. Okay, it's pretty obvious, you know. Me too. Uh, but I hate but it. honestly, what's the fucking point? Fat free milk. I get skim milk or not skim milk. I get the uh the 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 two percent. I get it. You want to reduce the calories a little bit, it's still basically milk, but fucking fat free, what's the fucking point? Just have water then. It's, uh, there's no yeah. fat in it. There's a point of milk. I don't get it. So yeah, what is this? I don't really get it either. Whip cream? See, I, I wasn't paying attention. Cool whip. It's cool whip. It's cool whip. Oh, I, I, her her audio is horrible and it was really grating on my Do you ears, so we're just cool gonna watch whip, Paul? Cool um it's yeah you know how easy cool it is whip. to make whipped cream at home do you know fucking super, how easy it is it's yeah. like super the easy. easiest thing you can make and it tastes a thousand times better than <laughs> i used to make whipped cream cool all day every day i worked at starbucks for eight years and so i used yeah, to have to yeah. make whipped cream and it's super simple and super cheap too you know honestly. you you know that stuff that that's become really popular at coffee shops is the uh, soft top stuff you can make uh, yeah. that at home really easily. I learned how to make that at home, and it's, like, awesome. Oh, you and, can make Starbucks uh, drinks at home relatively simply, most of them anyway, yeah, and have, them, it, yeah. have it be oh, pretty Oh, come on. Good. What is the point? Yeah. Why would you? Okay, okay, I'm in, calling it right now. This is a bit. This is a bit. Yeah, the way she's there is no way. all of them. I don't yeah, like exactly. your fingers yeah. all in my fingerprints all no over the gloves. Oreos. That's kind of like, gross. Yeah, but no why, gloves. And why, why would you soak it to make them disgusting and soggy before you put it into a pan with stuff that's going to make it soggy anyway? Like yeah, this is this she is just wouldn't. She's try. She's doing things that annoy people. You could you can kind of get a feel for it. This is yeah. this is she's trying to annoy people. And all this right, the hands are in there. Fetish. There's the fetish side of it. It's the wet, oh, messy. I didn't even think yep. about that. Is that a thing? The messy. It's hands a real thing. One hundred percent. So I wait. Hold on. I can explain this one for real. Yeah, go it's for an it. Actual real pet fetish called wet and messy, and it's okay. like um, um. In wet fact, and um, messy. I'm not kidding you. It's called wet and messy. It's called wet and messy because uh. it's like one of the main things is that they get stuff like sauces or lubricant. But the, a lot of the wet and messy stuff, they like stuff you can see. So. Uh, you know, like creams and stuff like whipped cream is really, really fucking common. So this and that's is a real messy, thing. This is wet this and is, messy. This is 100%. Made. Okay. 100%. In fact, um, uh, Tim and Eric made fun of that with a, they have a bit called uh, Tim's Cooking Show. And the entire thing is just, he finds excuses to make, to get like mustard or, or whipped cream all over everything. And he's getting it all over his shirt and he's rubbing it all over himself and he's rubbing his hands together. And uh, yeah. Uh, okay, hold on a second. We missed something. This? I missed something. I'm sorry. Okay, I was yeah, ranting yeah, yeah. about let's, the wet Let's roll it back. I was I was listening. Uh, and now, by the way, if yellow. you don't believe me, if anyone listening doesn't believe me, you can go look it up. You'll find it immediately. If you search wet and messy I, I anywhere believe. else besides TikTok, on TikTok, they disguise it as normal cooking content because that's what they do on TikTok. They have to disguise everything to avoid the censors. But on porn sites, you'll find it immediately. It's like that. It's crazy. Yeah. Yep. I, I I believe uh, being friends with TJ has opened my vanilla ass eyes to some crazy. I just know if it if you, you can think yep. of it, it exists as a fetish. Oh, one hundred percent, hundred percent. Yep. So yeah, we're um we're I think we're gonna pour some um some Jello in next. Yes, this is Jello. Or wait, I want to make sure. I'm gonna turn because this looks like pea soup or something. It looks this like weird. It looks like butter. Why is it? Yeah, why has it got that consistency to it? All right, audio back. Good, yes, yes, yes. Good. Oh yeah, yes, yes, yes. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm yeah. So she's messy. this is fetish, right, fetish. Yep. One, we're just gonna pour this pudding mixture Ooh. right on top. 
There's some yeah. naughty pudding yeah. mixture. That, why naughty. does that pudding look yeah. green and brown? Yeah, it's fucked up. Yeah. Um, like sludge. That looks... Yeah, what's in the bottom of it? That's fucked up. It looks like There's something, something wrong. It looks like somebody put a oh, yeah. Yeezy in there. It looks like a shoe is in there or something. What's the? Oh, it's the red from the cookie. <laughs> it does. It does. It does um, look like that. It's a yeah. crown in the Oreo. Yeah. This, yes. like, this is looking, oh, my God. This looks like something that would leak out of a garbage can or something. Um, this, is not, this is not a good yep. look. Bad. This is, this is a bit. I'm calling yeah. bit. I think you're right. Yep. Cool. So I put water in here instead of milk. Gross. Just so why? Yeah. What? Right. This is a bit. This is a bit. bit That's why it's gross. It, this is this it's is this is rage bait. Let's see how yeah, far she goes. Make we'll give it. With let's water. give it a shake. That's yeah. bullshit. That's just it. Just doesn't work right. Like you're just trying it up to be open minded and um, you know with this one. But yeah, I think this is a, nobody would pour a bunch of water on Oreos. Give me a break. Here. What's, what's that black stuff? Yeah, that is, it's the fucking mutagen from Ninja Turtles. You're right, dude. Yep. Master Splinter yep. found the turtles all coated in this shit and he raised them. That black <laughs> yeah. stuff is Oreos. Oh. The remnants of the Oreos. So you mixed. Yeah, Oreos. now you put some green glowing goo in it. It's going to taste delicious. And this now will, I'm just going like to, I just need to vomit. use something. <laughs> Listen, I'm so I look, I have a unique way of straining this. I need to strain it out. So I use a pair of my panties because they work really well to strain this. That's what's coming next. I swear to God. That if they were if they had courage, that's what they would do All next. Right, but they on, don't because they're on TikTok. I felt a little blood flow increase when you did that. Am I a fucking yep. messy and wet guy? Maybe I am. You might be. You like the idea of people filtering their putrid cooking through their panties? Yep, uh, you might you might oh, have found it. I that might have just my it. dream. Since a young boy, I've thought about that. Vanilla pudding. Just yep. kidding. That's disgusting. Exactly. Well, not disgusting. Whatever. Do we, do you? Nobody's getting hurt. Wait. So now that we've got that, we're gonna add a little bit more. Oh yeah, because you know what? Uh, this needed, come on, come on. This needed some more Cool Whip. I was wondering yeah. if this bitch was gonna only do one whole tub of Cool Whip. We got to do two. Our cool Come whip on. go right on top, and this is going to be the remaining of that cool whip. All right, so one whole tub of cool right whip on, on this. Top. Oh god! No. Oh, I'm just going to let it go. Ew! Okay. Uh, there's no, no, there's no way. There's no way anyone would want to eat this or make this recipe. This is a fucking joke. There's no way. I cannot. This see is what it looks like. This is what it looks like when you have somebody over at your house and they have like an allergic reaction to whatever you cooked, and you have to fucking try and clean out your toilet after they leave, and you use that foaming toilet spray stuff. This is what yeah. it looks like. There's just no way. There's no fucking possible. Way. No one's looking at this and is like, "Hey, what's the recipe for that? That looks good. That looks appetizing." Which is part of the Rage appeal bait. of food is that yep. is that you want to eat it. No, we got it. We got the bit. Smear out. Oh, yeah, and she's all touching it too, oh. so it's more wet and messy. It's more wet and messy. No, 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 no. You got any wet and messies in your audience, Demon Mama? I know I have some wet and messies in my audience. That's any, why they any, love Cooking Mama so much because we encounter the shit. I can't see your chat, so I want to see if any have come out in your chat. We they haven't come out. They won't come out because they know that during these segments that they'll the people will got a question. Would you rather eat spam or this? this wow really yes. really <laughs> really That's shocking man. have you That's... thought that through <laughs> I, I, as, as a third as a concerned oh. third party oh I can't oh we have multiple people now, after i mentioned the wet and messy people we put we, we now have at least one person possibly multiple posting uh uh pseudo ironic sweating emojis so i feel like wet got and messy spotted yep wet and messies yep. we see you caught in 4K. i bet you got them in your chat too maybe oh, it's you because got they don't saying... want to put this in their mouth they want to do something else to this so you know, maybe that you know so i get it maybe they want to put it somewhere they want else it what kind of no come on it looks they like might, it's already they might, they might want to dip their balls in it they might want to dip their balls in it i don't it, know it looks like it's been fucked all right. I think it's... the wet and messy, at least in my experience with observing this shit, uh, uh, like I, I think the wet and messy people they like they like it as like foreplay. You know what I mean? Yeah, and they like I to imagine. see a, a sexy woman covered in messy shit. There's yeah. another. There's a there's a format that's on Twitter that you'll see, or on not on Twitter on TikTok, which is that um, there'll be like um, there's like this one lady who like she'll like sit on the dough. 
she'll like make the dough and then she'll she'll like i need to squish it she'll like jump up and sit on it on the counter and yeah. she'll have like flour on her like a flower print of her ass on her jeans or whatever that's another thing they like that's oh, wow. really really common in the stuff kind of, kind of odd. i like that i like the little flower print on the jeans that's okay yeah all right we might have <laughs> found you this might be an awakening for you yeah, yeah i know i might have just a new fetish unlocked wet and messy this is not doing it for me though this looks like something she shouldn't be touching it looks like waste. yeah it's gross it does it looks like and her fingers waste, are yeah. all in it and she's just like man i would never oh dude I, I would eat after my mom if she cooked barehanded but even she wouldn't put her fingers all up in some shit like this hey, oh my god that's so much cinnamon that's a lot this of is rage bait rage bait a hundred percent rage bait uh sprinkles of course you gotta have sprinkles i don't mind the sprinkles honestly i'm a sprinkle apologist i like a sprinkle but a lot's a lot of sprinkles that's a lot of sprinkles so wait so you call them sprinkles up in uh I up do. in my neck of the woods where i come from they call them jimmies jimmy you ever heard that before no i've never yeah. heard that before yeah it's a new england thing they cool. call them jimmies learn yeah. something else new today nice also, another thing that's really funny is um, the the New Orleans accent has a lot of similarities to the specifically the Down East Maine accent, and that's because um, there is a shared ancestry there. Um, the Ac the Acadian people, yeah, exactly, the Acadian people who migrated from like basically the area that is now Canada and Northern Maine moved down to New Orleans, and. Yeah. Well, they, also did, so down to southern, southern they did so via the Mississippi coming out of the Great Lakes. So, yeah, they yep. came They're They're very, re uh, it makes sense that those regions would have. If you listen areas. to the, the main accent, which is like, hey, yeah, Bob, you know, yep. that type of thing sounds a, a whole lot like the New Orleans accent. It does. You're Orleans. right. Yep. I bet it does have a lot more similarities than you'd think. A lot. That's more. cool. There, yeah, let's see this finished yeah. product here. Is she going to bake right, this? Let's see it. No, it's just sitting no, up. No, it's just she like just, that. That's she just let that's how you know it's that's how you know for sure it's that's how you know. I will go ahead and take a bite. Okay. Mm, yummy, there you yummy. Go, oh, come mama. on. You get the first scoop of this snot textured gross. Oh shit. god. No, don't she do won't. it. No. Oh, oh, oh she cut a... away. She cut away. She uh, faked. Yep. She faked, faked it. She faked, cut away and then she faked. put a normal Oreo in her mouth and a little bit of the cream on her yeah, lips. See, That's sly. Right That's fucking sly. Uh, yep, yep, you're right. Also, Go I got to say, I got to say, she's a fucking cutie, though. She she's is. a fucking cutie, though. She'd get and it. And I love that. That fucking, the jumpsuit yeah. is like, I'm is not, jumpsuit? it's, doing, it's see, working it's on like me, It's like a military too. drab. Like, I like a, the workaday hair, too. She's a messy, cutie. The messy bun. Yeah. I'm into it. I'm with you, DM. Good taste. Good taste. But I, kind of I might try eyes, it. I might try eyes, it. Just to... The eyes of a man. She's faking it. I like, I like but, the crazy eyes. I like yeah. the crazy eyes, though. I like them crazy. I think a little bit. I'm, I'm changing my opinion. Now having seen her and now being uh, being slightly enamored, I think she's uh, I think she's on her hustle. It was actually she's really good. Yeah, it's it actually a really good attempt. If she made this and tried to feed me a spoon of it, I would eat it. Come on. <laughs> this is garbage. <laughs> I'd take a bite. <laughs> I take a bite for her. She's totally, she totally, she totally faked that though. She totally faked that. That is oh, that, that is was 100% the most. Fake. You could. Th there's no need to put in a cut there ever, unless not you're at all. It. I mean, you know, yeah. one. Dump I, I just want to see. I just want to see it one last time. I just want to see this bite one last time because this is a massive. Watch that cut. Yeah, watch that her. cut. Yeah. She gets a big snotty picture. Goes in. <laughs> jump cut. 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 Oh, she's that is so sly. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, that's nothing. Great. Now look at the spoon. Even I shows actually, it. the spoon even shows that she didn't take a yeah, bite. look at the spoon. Didn't take a bite. Bullshit. Oh my god, that's amazing. If this was a, okay, when have you ever made a delicious dessert and not fucking nommed that bite? Nobody never. does that. That's totally, yeah, she's never. totally got this. This is totally rage bait. It was a work. Okay. I, it was a work for I sure. I know we have, wait, how much more stuff do we have on the list for tonight? Last thing. We have reached the thousand dollar goal. This is our final okay. thing for the night. And can, I, can I do something really fucking annoying though? Can I do one Absolutely. something that's really annoying that is on, on par for the bad cooking? Can I recommend a video? Please. That is a classic. Okay. Go, Go to YouTube and search up on aunt mirna's 
party cheese salad because I'm telling you, you will not regret this. This your audience. How many people we got here right now? We got fucking still, still 655. That's amazing. Your guys' audience is cool. Yeah, Can I say that? Out. Can I say that's fucking awesome? Huh? You guys out. are cool. They Please like let's watch Aunt Mirna's party cheese salad by Jack's Cooking. It is I one of it. the greatest genuine bad oh, cooking I've ever seen in my entire life. It's not fake. And I can tell you we're gonna, with 100% assurity, this guy is not a bit. He is incapable of doing a bit. He is like, um, he's he currently still films himself. Um, this is it. Oh my God, you guys are gonna love this shit. Warning, uh, ear rape at the beginning. Just be careful. It's gonna be really fucking loud for like a couple okay. seconds I'll in crank, the beginning. I'll crank it down uh, to save. Yeah, she, she, they up the audio but i'm telling you this is a gift okay for my for my viewers you guys sit down and buckle in because you all watch watch the youtube chat okay because the if these guys have never seen this you guys are in for a treat because i've made you guys watch this like three times in the past four years so buckle all in. right here we go you know what time it is it's time for aunt Myrna's recipe so this guy's a character okay i'm telling sure. you if you ever are looking for cooking content, this is the guy. You go check out his his backlog because he's magical okay. and a horrible asshole. So you don't have to feel bad about laughing about him. It's a double header. That's right. Last week we did Aunt Myrna's recipe with the coleslaw. Amazing. This week we're doing party cheese salad. When I saw her make this in Alabama, I was like, Eesh. I'm not sure about some of these ingredients, but then I tasted it and it's like a dessert. Uh, it's really cool. It's so actually pretty this, damn good. All this on the stove, then we're going to pour it in this glass. You are not prepared for this. This is so fucked up. Uh, this, yeah. I think my mom gave me this, but <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't this, look like there's chill a lot of offensive so ingredients be sitting there. Those look okay. Jello. And oh, just you wait. Cool just you fucking wait. You wait. Hold on. Let me tell you. What do you think is in that red jar right there? Cherries, oh. I assumed. Cherries. cherries. Okay, good guess. Excellent. Good guess. You're completely wrong, but good guess. Looks like maybe okay. my chat, be a jam. My website chat, by the way, all my OG imps, that because I can tell I know these people in my chat on the website right now. These are the fucking people who've been with me forever. They're losing their shit. They're so excited for you guys to see this. Just okay. Look, this is amazing. I can't. Oh, laughing. Cherries, cherries, cherries. I'm screaming. <laughs> all right, let's do this. This is great. Ladies, see this. I never would have put these ingredients together. Do you see it? Do you see the lid? <laughs> Uh, that is pimento olives. <laughs> That's not okay. Cool. <laughs> okay, we're we're right. we're entering the fucking twilight. I'm telling no, you, no, no. you're gonna get to witness this guy. He's not. This is not a bit. This guy does not do a bit. I've been watching this guy for a long time. He is not a bit. There's this not a real. bit in his bone. Okay, this He's is one hundred percent real. And cool whip. He's, this, this guy is, is gonna. He's gonna go in, and he's gonna go in for seconds not a bit in his fucking body okay Green cheese okay pimentos Ugh. cool whip no crushed nuts a match <laughs> made in hell okay oh. perfect <laughs> or you can use lime jello celery? celery bell pepper pineapple and american cheese uh, you dude you this is you like this guy was this. asked to get 10 ingredients in like two seconds like look you got 30 yeah. seconds grab 10 things and make a dish you know it what comes this off like of? a, you guys a, ever you guys ever see that show chopped where they give them obscenely weird yeah ingredients? yes that's what this yes. Must, i was literally gonna like say it comes basket. off like a chop thing but he yeah. chose to make this and not only this but his aunt appeared to endorse the recipe like this oh, is God. really actually her recipe it's real good. That's cute and I disgusting. You're gonna like it. Can you believe this? This is crazy. Let's go to the stove right now and get this thing started. Let's take not. your crushed pineapples and pour it in the pan. All right, I like pineapples. Not too bad. All that preservative juice too. All right. Mm. Your, uh... All right. <laughs> I'm gonna do something that I don't really believe in. <laughs> Sorry for the coughing. I'm gonna do something I don't really believe in. Lord, baby. Jesus, in your swaddling diaper clothes, sitting in a manger, please don't let this man put the pimentos in with this. Please say it was a joke. In your name, we play. Play. I guess that works. I'll I'll leave that typo in there. In your name, we play, God. Please don't oh, do it to me. I'm. It's been a long show. I'm on running on fumes here, God, and I need him to not put those pimentos in this shit. Okay. 
Thank you, God. A very genuine amen. A very genuine amen, amen. for me. I certainly amen. don't know the answer to this. Your will yes. be done, Lord. In one large jello. Well, God wills it all. God wills <laughs> this. I had to hedge my bets because I really don't. I grabbed a large one. I don't want to see it. In Paul's desperation, he turns okay. to the worst possible go. place. Jello in. So far, not horrible. Like Jello with pineapple in it, it's probably. I mean, yeah, that could work. Bad. There's a universe that works, in, right? There's sure. even dishes that work in this universe. Sure what you tell oh, for 100. percent So far, you know, like okay. gelatin with fruit in it, totally fine. Yeah, totally fine. It's not, yeah. It's, you know what? Not so bad. By the way, I'm gonna echo what Demon Mama said. Donate. You're getting an extra crazy food tonight because Demon Mama. And you deserve she true. She deserves to see the fucking make it rain. Okay, make it rain. Make it like rain. I'm club. telling you, if you're loving this, make it rain. If you're it laughing, if you're having a good time. If you needed a little fucking get away from the crazy drama bullshit of life and have a laugh with uh, some good people tonight, and you're enjoying it, please give us some money. We love you. Thank you. This. We don't actually love you, by the way, but we do care about you, and we appreciate you. So. I want to be parasocial. I'm just going to mix it up right now. Okay. There we go. Not so bad. Later oh. on, if I use a wooden spoon, it's going to stick to the wooden spoon. All right, so we're going to get this all mixed up. Please no pimento. Okay, once the jello is dissolved, yeah. you're yeah, going to okay. add, I chopped up the cream cheese. You're going to add all, all your right. cream cheese well, in there. I mean, I'm already the kind of not like... I mean, I've had Jello puddings before, and this is okay so far. This yeah, is, I mean, I'm, I'm not the world. grossed. Yeah. I will say, like a block of cream cheese in in with pineapple Jello is, it's That's not like when you think about it, you're like, okay, cream cheese goes good in sweet dishes. There's like lots of cream te- cheese dishes with sweetness. Cream cheese is good with you know jelly. There's all kinds of things you can do with cream cheese. But when you think a little harder, you go, hold on a second dairy product in hyper acidic hyper enzymatic jello mixture yeah. yeah you see where it's starting to get weird yeah it's starting to yeah. start to look like a curdle situation to me a cur- exactly insta curdle yep and you're going to mix that until it totally mixes in totally melts down okay i mean i like cream cheese don't get me wrong so this doesn't like much flavor down. wise turn me off of pineapple in there yeah, you, you it's can still pineapple-y, be. It, it's creamy. It can still be something. It, it can still be something. You know. Yeah, I mean, sweet, look. You know. Yeah. I'm, I'm not optimistic, but I mean, it's not ruined. Thank it's you, a. It's thank a bad you, look. Thank you, you know. Yeah, that's right. I love to see it. That's the rest of the ingredients. Gonna but the uh, chopped uh, celery. Okay. Celery. We, Houston, we have a problem. Steve? Oh no! It doesn't need to go in there, sir. No, that's a no. No, okay, and it went in. Don't All right. Oh yeah. Well. Steep. Yep. Well, the yep. bell peppers going right uh, in there. Huh? Right in there. No. Right on. You can there. imagine, yeah. right? Like when when the no. when you're at the no. point. <laughs> and that's oh, the pimentos, God. and you'll notice. Uh, just a small detail a lot of people don't notice on their first view through but that i'll give you having seen this video many times he empties the whole jar so that's all the pickle juice that's in there as well yeah, all that pimento fucking, juice is going straight in yeah, you got some yeah, crazy flavor profiles yeah. you got sweet you've got sour you've got like it's really true. salty you got a ton of salt in there now yeah, unbelievably yeah. salty like you've got so salty the celery is going to absorb all of that too because it doesn't have much flavor Fiber. on its own yeah, a lot of fiber. So when a lot of people see the first part, you know, with the pineapple and the cream cheese, a lot of people go, okay, I can imagine a pineapple cheesecake that tastes good. Yes. But then you each step, it immediately gets worse. You think pineapple cheesecake, okay, that's the charitable version. Obviously, a block of cream cheese in pureed pineapple is not does not make a cheesecake. It makes slop. But even sure. if we're charitable, you imagine that, and then you think, chunks of celery ah shit and then you go chunks of fucking green pepper and it's like what the can you imagine what it would be like to bite into a piece of like you go to cheesecake factory you get a pineapple cheesecake because you're feeling tropical and you take a bite and the first thing you get is that like 
that crunch yeah. and then a, a green pepper blast or a yeah. celery blast or and then the fucking pimento yeah. and the pimento just d- j- it's gone there's no this hope is, at all whatsoever in any what? world this is a war crime this this shouldn't exist this has been going from bad to worse Next time, next time this we do anything together, I'll show you another one from this guy that is legendary <sighs> as well. Okay, because this guy's got a million. All right, I'll show Nuts. you the sous vide episode, or I'll show you the fucking church cookout episode, which is one of the greatest of all time. <laughs> but... No, not not the cookout, not the cookout. All right, <laughs> Wait, he my... poisons his fucking church. <laughs> I'll tell. You, I don't want to spoil. I'll tell you next time. Next time. Next splashing time. Splashing out. Okay. Splashing out. Thank you all so much. Thank, thank you, you guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Beautiful. Th- hey, look at that. that. Look at those tips. You're getting extra that show tonight. This beautiful. is a long, girthy show, and thank you for showing your appreciation. We do this appreciate. This is a that. demon mama style show. Fucking nine hours a day, ten days a week. This is girthy. I don't know how you do that, demon mama. <laughs> Now mix it all together. You must oh, be eating worse. this. You you must be eating this. I feel like he's making a fucking omelet, dude. Energy. I feel like he's making a perverse omelet right? at this dude, point. Legit, it looks like a fucking the, omelet. The, the, right? the anime betrayal of the year. Demon Mama eats this every day to fuel her fucking interminable streaming. Can't even begin to today. I you. today I had delicious fried chicken. I will say so. Not this, but that's that sounds good. How amazing! This is not good though. You think this was? How it amazing! Looks horrible, but I'm telling you, Aunt Myrna never has failed me yet, and I have had this. So I hope I. <laughs> Aunt Myrna hasn't failed me yet. I think she failed you a long time ago. Yeah, I think Aunt Myrna is trolling your ass, dude. I don't yeah. think Aunt Myrna likes yeah. you. She gave you. She made this shit up. This is this is horrid. It turns out it's good. <laughs> Jack has Jack certified has no taste buds. Um, he can't taste fucking shit. And a recurring theme in his videos is that he'll he'll like basically pressure his wife into tasting his food, and she's never once reacted well to his food. So I think he legitimately is like lacking the ability to taste what the shit tastes like. Yeah, I would agree. Okay. Looking at this, okay. I've turned the flame off. I'm just mixing it in now. Okay, so go ahead and turn your flame off. Oh, you know, this all. honestly, turn like, if I turn off. my brain off, I made quiche one time. This honestly looks like a quiche. If I turn my brain off, I can imagine he's making a quiche and not pimento jello, okay? Yeah, right? If you uh, if you think, if you don't think about what's actually in there, it does kind of look like he's prepping a quiche, and you can yeah. almost get through it. But you won't, but that won't last. I'm so sorry to tell you it won't last. Oh, Just God. pretend it's something else. Right, here's the crucial ingredient. Uh, no! Step away from the stove. Please stop, sir. Stove. Put your hands <laughs> in there. They sir. were the food police when you need them. I'm begging you, sir. Please don't do this. For the love of God and all that's holy, please don't oh, do this. Not cool. Not the cool. Don't do it. Don't no! not the whole thing, sir. <laughs> sir. Ah! sir, it doesn't oh, need no! like... The yellow! The yellow oh. and green! <laughs> oh my fucking god that means okay i'm starting to feel vomit, it dude. <laughs> okay this is turning my stomach i'm starting to feel the queeze queeze factor five queeze factor Listen, five another thing by the way another thing that i have to say one small compliment i have to make to jack's cooking okay this is going to come out of totally out of left field but look at how clean his his countertop is his stovetop you know that is shiny. who I what mean, you know most of the time they never clean their their stovetop so you know credit where credit is due anyway wow. look at that delicious green snot residue that he leaves oh. in the who whip can oh god dude that was actually some nice eye bleach demon mama thank you but you brought me right back <laughs> you brought me right back to the <laughs> the wrath of cool whip that he's plopped in the middle of this hideous devil's concoction that he's made <laughs> <laughs> this is in fact you know what i i think the devil's pretty fucking chill and cool uh this is the, this is worse than the devil this is horrible this is oh what we God. this is what we serve to people in the ninth circle of hell okay this is what hitler fed his dogs okay <laughs> like let's be real this is, a, this is a adolf hitler recipe if ever Dude, i've seen hitler did not hate his dogs enough to do this you're thing. right he loved his dogs you're right yeah, there's no way Hitler would have done this to his dogs. He would have had right. the, he would have had the SS execute the person that fed this to his dogs. Yes. Spill over. 
Oh god, it's so yellow. I don't recommend oh my god, the uh, yellow is really not the, uh, doing. Cool whip. Dog All right. vomit. Oh. Imitation. <laughs> Ooh, do you see those pimentos in there? Isn't that horrible when one of the pimentos surfaces? Ladies and gentlemen, I hate to interrupt the show, but we have a stage six um quiz event in progress at the Paul's Ego Households. Shelter in place. Um, do not uh do not leave your home. This oh is my God. We did it. I'm having yes, we did it. I'm having Scotty slurping that fucking spam jelly off the top of that thing feelings in my stomach right now i'm just letting you know just think about think about it okay audience this one you can plug your ears paul if you need to okay but i want okay. you to think I'll, about what I'll, it would I'll, be like I can tough it out. if you got a big bite okay you go and you mm. take a bite of 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 pineapple flavored jello with whipped cream imagine. like a pudding you know and okay, then a yeah. pimentos in there and then a fucking pimentos in there okay <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my that god was, that was tough okay very yeah, queasy. Right? no very queasy right it's terrible right oh my god my eyes are watering now yep okay yep it's well you know what cream let's keep mm. going you don't have cool whip oh mix cool. that dog right vomit together the paul yummy, oh it's yummy. a bloody cum or something it's yummy so fucking the gross side. oh the chunks did you see the chunks in that frame oh, no. look at that yeah. go back like two oh, frames now we're gonna get look some at chunky it. pour look chunky at it look at it no, 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 you gotta no, no, go no. back just two frames watch watch when he takes it off just a little really? further and watch when it is he he cuts a little bit yeah, there's like a fade cool. and it goes to the fully stirred version Premius, you can oh, it's not God. a phase. He's folding it in. I and you're gonna watch the cums. The Look, there it is, oh, right there, right there. Oh, yeah. oh, God, those? Jiggle. Nice and curdled. Nice jiggle, and chunky. Oh, the fucking it's curdling. He's got cream. <laughs> he's got fucking whipped cream in there. He's got fucking cheese in there, and it's all. Paul, curdling. do you have a trash can next to you? <laughs> I'm asking, sir, Paul, do you have a trash can next to you? Because they're about to. Julia brought me some ginger to settle my tummy. Thank you, baby. I love you. <laughs> Because the pour is oh about to God, happen. That's love tell. right there. She that's loves love. Her. Is that's that love? love? I'm eating ginger. It's that's ginger. It's love. a five alarm fire at this point. It's ginger. We're going to the ginger to <laughs> prevent the uprising because this is getting real gross. I do not. Can I tell you guys something? I do not want to see him pour that into this dish. I don't oh, want to see the lumps don't. and the bumps and the plops oh. and the plops. I don't want to see it. It's coming. It's coming. You better get that ginger in you. Just embrace and embrace it as well. Oh my god, it's like he's fing shitting in a toilet the way it splattered. <laughs> that is <laughs> Wait, we can't see it. I don't think we, we can see, see it. it. I think you're still on the screen. Yeah. You're gonna have to watch it again. Oh no. <laughs> the yep, that's true. To go, to. See it, Paul. <laughs> go back a little bit. All right, there you go. Now, now we gotta let's see that pour again. Let's see that again. <laughs> Last dish can you here. slow it down, Paul, so we can see it in slow motion? Oh. 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 oh! look at it! Listen to the sound, too. The sound. Hear the sound. Just give him a second so that, that, that the audience can hear just how bad the fucking sound is. It's so Oh, they can hear it. They can hear it in fucking beautiful .5 slow-mo. Your wish is my command, Scotty. Thank you. Last dish here. Then you're going to pour it in the... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna fucking pass out. Paul's dying. <laughs> Watch it slowly drip into the machine. <laughs> it, it truly does. <laughs> It's warned that's the warning shots that the, the those gags are the warning shots. It's not coming up yet, but it's telling me chunky it's telling and creamy. It's gonna, it's gonna come out. Oh my How's it so God. thick. That I'm gonna fucking spew. It's gonna happen. This is gonna do it to me. <laughs> oh my god, those pimentos. No, no. All right, no more like, slow-mo. It's like vomit. Executive Central, decision, dude. normal speed from now on. No more slow-mo. I can't do it. Yeah, don't leave any in the pan. 
Oh God! All right. Okay, I'll wait. Before we get to the next, right, before hold, we get to the next pause, period, pause, okay? Ready? Pause, 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 I want pause. you to think about what the next agenda. step is, okay? What's the next step? All right. Do you think he's gonna cook it? I need another or gender is there candy. Be another, a I got another step? gender candy. Hmm. Uh, is he gonna I'm guessing, cook it? Um, I'm guessing fridge. I'm guessing the he fridge. Has to, right? No, guess, no, no, no. It ain't so. No, no, no. He has to put this in the oven at least, right? Uh -uh. And soften up some of that veggies. I don't think so, dude. No? I think this is going in the fridge. It better not. What go would be fridge. what? I want you to think about what the worst possible decision could be, and then that is the and that's that's where Jack's cooking always goes. Okay, the worst possible decision. Well, just, the just way to nothing. make the texture the it, most leave, repulsive. Just leave it out. That'd be the worst possible move, in my opinion. That is the worst possible. Yeah, but it's pretty. Close. Maybe, maybe, maybe the second worst possible in this particular game. I think mm -hmm. you were, I think you were on the right, right measure there. Personally, I think it's the worst. Like leaving it out, there's nothing that really spoils all that bad if you eat it quickly. But to me, it's yeah. like if you make the, if you make the veggies spongier if I saw flies and harder to eat. Oh, I'm telling you, that's the next, that's the next stage of queez. Yeah. Well, this one, not in this one. No flies in this one. So you're lucky. Okay, good. Pineapples all throughout the. Uh... Make sure, Make sure them chunks are distributed nice and evenly. Put your spoon gently. Yep. You Dude, your Frodo Baggins, moment. you better be wrong. Pineapple. You Just better be trolling. Out. He better not be fucking up mayonnaise. The last step. You're going to sprinkle on some cheese. Oh, no. Top. No, but why, sir? Sir? That's not enough cheese, though, there. for that. You're Even hurting you the planet. Put... You're hurting the planet, sir. Please stop. Why is he skimping on the cheese? That is pretty skimpy on the cheese, but I'm glad. I don't. It doesn't need more. No more cheese. I would need it no matter what. Put quite a bit of cheese on. That's 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 not scampi cheese. He put the whole thing on there. And then we're gonna take a look at it in the morning. Okay, so when you see when you see cheese sprinkled on top of something like it's you go, different. okay, obviously he's got to obviously he's got to bake it right because like why else would you sprinkle cheese on the top right? Like like you don't eat like shredded cheese like that. It's just not the way no, like people do. Some it. people grab a little handful. You melt it. Otherwise, you just eat the cheese normally because the shredded cheese is just annoying. It doesn't taste good like that. Well, oh my god! Just, I'm you yeah, shred it so it can melt easier. That's the whole I'm point sweating, of shredding it. I'm sweating like Chank Uger on election night 2016, bro. This is not. <laughs> this is not pleasant. This is not pleasant. Someone dab Paul. <laughs> Give Paul a wet, <laughs> cool wet rag. Yeah, I need a dab. Oh, no, I'm kidding. I'm fine. It's, it's not bad, but I think yeah, delicious. The cold, no, it is not going to be delicious, Four sir. Hours left later. I realized I didn't have to wait overnight. And so he left it out. Right. He just left it out. He puts it in the fridge, is what he says. He yep, says he puts I, it in the fridge I, for four that's what hours. I was thinking. That's what and I, I want you to just watch this. Just watch what it oh, looks no. like at the end. Oh, now you're great. right. I do deal. think I I I may have may have made a small misstep in saying the worst possible decision because given that there's dairy in there, leaving it out at room temperature probably is the worst decision. But in my mind, no, I go towards. Bears. Yeah, I I think though like like putting it in the fridge, it's like you're going to have peppers and pimentos and cut up celery that are sitting soaking up gelatin, cream pineapple enzymes in cold temperature i want like the texture of what that must be it's got to be something akin to like biting a piece of like raw meat fat right like that oh. that like you know what i mean it's got that rubbery give to yeah. it where it like it yeah, pushes back but it's also your like soft bounce, your teeth bounce see. off of it when you try and exactly bite it. Just imagine uh, what, like you know, a celery is. The thing about celery is it's so watery. It has um, it has like you know, what's the little tube, the xylem and the phloem that those things suck yeah, up everything pause, around it. And what it's, it's like eating up, a booger, dude. It looks like eating like a cheese. Booger. Yeah, straight up <laughs> with cheese and with shredded cheese specifically <laughs> on top. Paul died. Oh God! All right, yeah, that's gross. Well, what's he doing to it? We've only been chilling this for about four hours. But as you can tell, uh, it's ready. Uh, yeah, let's have some. It's like mm. fucking set up. Oh no! Ain't you hungry, Paul? <laughs> that looks. I have a bite, sir. Looks. You know not. You've never <laughs> seen beauty, if you'd call that beautiful, sir. All right. So let's, uh, sir, let's serve up a little section. Don't do here. it, sir. Don't break that crust, right sir. The world doesn't need what's you in there, sir. It, almost like a dessert. Don't know it is not, sir. Out. Oh God! 
Yes, I see. That's on a plate. That's on a plate for you, Paul. There you go. Here's your helping. And now it does on the surface when you're looking at it, it kind of looks a little bit like a like a like a quiche, but there's no egg in there. That is all congealed pineapple and and whipped cream and cream cheese with veggies and pimentos in there. And remember the jello that was used and cheddar is cheese, lime jello. cheddar cheese, lime and cheddar, cheddar cheese, lime top jello, with cheddar, bag top supermarket with cheddar. cheddar on top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got it. Of that. Yep. That's what you have to remember. When you know what? I hate thing. to. I, I, I'm gonna hot take. Step aside, Holocaust. There's a new contender in town. I'm sorry. This may be humanity's lowest point. And if you'll believe it, this isn't even his Good. worst. This man. This be is his. Mo- this is probably his most mm. famous, but it's not his worst. His worst is is the multiple episodes in which he actively makes when he actively endangers the people that he's feeding, um, which are many episodes. Well, Uncle Gumballed, I tell you what, bro. If you if I choke on my vomit live on stream, it's on you, buddy. You did this to me, sir. Uh, no, That's one funny. of my OGs right there. Uncle Gumballed has been this with me a, for fucking a million years, okay? This is a well-worn meme in our community. I have a notoriously weak stomach, okay? Certain things put me really ready to launch the to f- hurl, you know what I mean? Sir, yeah. all right, can I tell you something, sir? You've created a Lovecraftian abomination, and you do not have to eat that, sir. You do not have to bite it. Step I will away forgive from you. Him. If you, you know what, sir? He I likes- would forgive you if you take that right now and you take that whole thing to the toilet and you put it in there where it belongs and but you this flush is, it. Paul, this is ants recipe. You're gonna have to eat some. Boy. You don't have to eat this, sir. It's good. It's good eating, boy. Of course, I don't know if mine mm. came out of it. So here's. Oh my god! Don't do it. Yes. Tell me if you see a cut. Okay. Yes. Tell me if you see a cut. No cut. No oh. cut. No cut. He li- no, he likes. I'm this telling shit. you. Oh my god. He, not only that, he likes it oh. and watch 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 keep watching hold on hold look at on. how much more of the video is left i have to we're doing an audio boost situation temporarily because i want to hear that bite <laughs> look look at the replay look at on the on the youtube it tells you how know, many times people have popular. replayed the, the bite other people have done this <laughs> Other people have done this. All right. That's about as loud as I can get it without really going crazy. So let's see what happens here. Everybody listen. All right. And you know what? Just to make sure we catch it all, I am going to slow mo it again. All right. We're going to do it real quick here. We're going to do a half speed and we're going to really all going to be quiet. We're going to focus on this bite. Okay. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh, good. I know it. I bet you do. Of course, I don't know if mine came out as good. So, here's to delicious tasting. Oh, it's crunch! Oh, it's crunch! <laughs> mm. it's, it's, it's soft yet crunchy, Paul. <laughs> that's like eating a that's like eating a bowl of pudding and having one of those fucking garden beetles in there, one of those green garden beetles. <laughs> crunch. I am. You can um, hear that crunch yeah, loud enough really to be could, picked up by his mic. You could feel it. You could feel that it. sounded like that sounded like a Dave Portnoy pizza bite that would get an eight point two. All right, that crunch. That crunch was retarded. Crispy. Crunchy. Oh, oh my god. Easy. And this shit eating grin on this fucking ogre's face is really starting Dude, to piss that me is off. a look. I've only seen this look a couple times in my life. This guy is looking at like how TJ looks at corn pop with like love and admiration. <laughs> he does. He is. It's genuine he admiration for Aunt Tilly's fucking disgusting that, puke that's vile the most vomit. Incredible shit. thing about this entire video is this guy actually likes this shit. He likes it. He does. He really he's does. not faking. Yeah. He's, he's in love with it. He's in love he with it. He wants it. Yep. He's gonna eat this whole fucking thing probably later because he's a big guy. I'm not trying to hate, but later he's probably gonna fucking be online. He's oh, gonna have this in his lap. Yeah, this have one. this in his lap and fucking just take a spoon and just go. It blows my mind. Yeah, does it? That it's so sweet and dessert like. 
and has all those vegetables in it. Well, that's the only thing I've agreed with you. It blows my mind too, sir. Not for the same reason. <laughs> and American cheese on top. It is really... Oh, it's so good. I don't believe you. So I don't believe you. I can't explain this to you guys. It's... I will never check out any website that's affiliated with you, nor would I ever considering consider buying any sauce from you. I am not going to the best sauces.com. You're not luring me with your free shipping, sir. I don't trust you as far as I can pick your big ass up and throw you. And I couldn't throw you so, anywhere. There's a, there's so much lore to this guy. Okay. There's so much I could tell you, but there's yeah. another video of his that's so next time, another time we'll do, I'll, I'll give you some of his best videos of all time, just so you can experience them. But another Absolutely. thing that he's done, he has one video that this kind of just tells you the type of personality he is. He has a video where he does a, um, he does a, Korean, he calls it, I think he calls it like a Korean steak sandwich or something, okay? And he doesn't use a single Korean ingredient, nothing, not one Korean ingredient, but he calls it Korean steak sandwich. And he like harangues his wife on video in an edited video. He's not a live streamer. He like bothers his wife and she's clearly not into it. And he, and, and he has her come in and taste it. And she's just like, yep, it's a sandwich. And he keeps that in the video, and he's just grinning from ear to ear. The guy is the most – he is 100% legit. Like, he he is not faking even a tiny bit. There's not a single bit in there. His latest videos are, like, really weird because oh, – I don't want to get it. I'll get to that next time. Yeah. Next time you'll get the full lore. His latest videos are really fucking weird. It's how you know that there's not even a drop of bit in his personality. Yeah, I am. Um, well, that was rough for me. That one, I got to be honest with you, Demon Mama. That one was, I did not expect it. That one You're snuck welcome. up on me. You're welcome. I have to stand up You're a little welcome. bit because I have a cramp in my leg from all of that heaving. I'm going to do that real quick.